In this video, I'm going to go over the fitness reality adjustable bench to see if it's something you can add to your home gym. So let's jump right into this review. So the fitness reality adjustable bench is a bench you can use in your home gym that comes with 12 different angled positions, allowing you to do a lot of different exercises, especially if you have something like dumbbells at home. For those of you who follow this channel, you know I'm using the core fitness dumbbells as of shooting this video, and it is my staple when using this bench in order to do a lot of my pressing movements as well as some pulling in my training routine. Taking a look at the purchase details, I bought this product from Amazon.com back on March 18th of 2019. At the time, this product was labeled at $89.07. Now today, as of shooting this video, it is July 27th. I took a look at the website to see what it's currently running at on Amazon, and it is showing at $119 uh, if you purchased it today from Amazon.com. That is a jump of $29.93 since I bought the original in March of 2019. All right, let's break down the details of the Fitness Reality Adjustable Bench. So first off, they recommend that no one over 6'4 buy this product. So you can be 6'4 or less. I couldn't find a minimum value, but they just say basically 6'4 is the max height you should be. And this bench can support up to 800 pounds. I don't come anywhere close to that using it from home, but maybe you're someone who can bench a lot of weight or something like that and you need to watch out for the high, high weights, just know this can support up to 800 pounds of weight. All right, so this bench has a total of 12 positions that you can put the back part of the bench up or down at different angles. So the bench does go from a negative 20% angle all the way up to 80% positive. Um, and just note, because there's two different heights that you can put the actual bench at, that's what makes it the 12 angles. What you'll be doing is setting the seat higher or lower based on how tall you are, allowing you to get deeper with something like, again, a decline sit-up, or if you want to just put it higher in general to get it off the floor a little more. And lastly, it does fold up a little bit, allowing you to put it into storage. So if you're putting it in something like a closet, you can do that. For me personally, I tend to leave it out in my workout office area. Um, it just kind of sits there. But if you want to fold up and put it in the closet, you can. No, it doesn't get that much smaller. All you're essentially doing is taking that front foot and putting it up underneath, but it is possible to kind of roll it up and put it in a closet to hide it from plain view. And that's it for the basic information of this bench. Now let's go over my pros and cons list for the Fitness Reality Adjustable Bench. So after one year, this bench has been awesome. I've had no problems with it. It looks like it pretty much just came out of the box, maybe a little dustier than out of the box, but honestly, none of it's tearing away. The fabric of the actual cushion has stayed intact. There's no uh, seams coming undone and no nothing. It is still in great, working and looking order. Just as on day one, I can simply change the angle of the bench as needed. Now I don't go through too many of them. I mostly keep it flat or put it at just a single level up in terms of the angle just to get a little bit more of the upper chest. But other than that, I keep it pretty much the same way. You can put it fully vertical if you want to do something like uh, overhead shoulder press by just sitting on the bench or seated shoulder press. But just know how I've used it, it's worked very well. I use it multiple times a week for many, many different exercises. It's holding up. I've had nothing break on it. No, nothing. It's still great product, especially if you have something like dumbbells. So playing off of that, dumbbells are pretty much a must with this thing, um, unless you have a bench you're using it for, like an actual bench at your home. For me, it works great with dumbbells. My favorites are, again, the incline bench press. I also do incline rows. So to hit your back, I do more rows. And I sometimes do things like seated curls, uh, seated overhead presses. Sometimes them come in there, but for the most part, I use it for that incline benching and incline rows. All right, and that's it for my pros. Let's take a look at my cons list. The only real con I have with this product is the ability to fold it. It's kind of annoying. It doesn't really get that much smaller. Again, you're just taking that front angled foot and flipping it underneath but it really doesn't make it that much smaller than it was before. So the last question I like to always ask myself is would I buy this product again? And the question is, if you're looking for a bench, this one is amazing. I would even buy it for the $119 price just because I think it has brought me that much value for how long I've had it. Again, I'm using this for multiple exercises per week. Again, things like the incline bench press, incline rows, hip thrusts, uh, static lunges, all of those things which I test out and use in my programs, I do with this bench each and every week. Now, if you did watch my last weekly recap video, I went over them trying to minimize my home gym equipment, and this actually came up as one as a possible solution to being removed. The main reason is the cost overall. Again, I think it's provided me some insane value for what I paid for it, 
but I can see where this could be a hassle in that it takes up a lot of room and maybe can't, people can't afford a $119 product right now. So I wanted to see if I could do something like just using the floor and bent over rows and other things like that to get in my training and just not do incline uh, bench pressing anymore and that kind of stuff. But just know, I would 100% buy this if I am ever looking for another bench in the future. And that's about it on this follow-up review after using the Fitness Reality Adjustable Bench for over a year and a half. If you did like this review, please like and subscribe to GamerBody for more videos just like this one. Also, don't forget to head over to GamerBody.com. There you can check out my current training program, the equipment I own and use, as well as the resources I'm learning from to build muscle, burn body fat, and gain confidence all from the comfort of home. And that's it. So again, please like and subscribe. I'll see you all in the next video. Be fit and game on.